There are so many factors that have contributed to COA's success, but I think first, second, and third is tenacity. I had this discussion yesterday with one of my doctors who said, you've been doing this for so long, and there's not such a huge change in community cancer. But I said, you can't look at it that way. You gotta look at it as, what did we not lose? We're still independent. We're still the ones actually on the forefront taking care of the most underserved patients in the United States. You know, we're still living our mission, and that's because of what COA enables us to do. When you're the COA president, everything you do is a blur because every day there's a crisis in community oncology somewhere that you need to help support. Some of the important and amazing things we were involved in was stopping the, the Part B experiment, was gonna significantly decrease the reimbursement for what we do every day, and most practices would not have survived it. I'm very proud of our involvement there, and we saved probably half a community oncology doing that. My name is Jeff Aserka, and I am Community Oncology.